my lovelies. Um, I have a really exciting video for you today. Um, it's evening outside, if you couldn't tell that this is really artificial lighting. So I have got some shoes to show you and you can probably um, tell what they are um, by the title above but I'm not going to reveal them for a little bit. But basically these shoes have been a long time. I first ordered these shoes a couple days after my birthday which was back in, on the 2nd of July so well over a month now and I um, ordered them as a kind of a birthday present to myself. I had a bit of birthday money and I was like why not I've been wanting these for a while why don't I just buy them and um, whilst I was in India I got an email from Karma Loop which is the website I bought them off saying I had to authorise my payment and I didn't have my computer properly to do it with so um, I tried to do it on my phone and I messed it up and basically the order was cancelled so then I came back home and um, I then went off to Mallorca and I was looking at shoes online in Mallorca as I do all the time and I thought I would rebuy them so I finally bought them there and um, they finally just arrived yesterday after some issues with shipping and, and customs and stuff because the slip didn't come through which you have to pay it with whatever so they finally arrived so I've been waiting for these shoes for ages and I'm finally going to show you them here they are! They are so beautiful. Look at the colours in on the camera. Look really, really nice. Um, basically, obviously, they're the Jeffrey Campbell damsels. And what drew me to this particular um, pattern or style is the combination of the yellow and the purple. I think it looks really nice. And I am a hater of yellow. I actually really don't like yellow, but um, I really think the combination on this is really nice. It's also like a pastel yellow um it's really nice i just i just really love the yellow and the purple together i think they look beautiful and of course i love my platform boots i love the fact that they look a bit like hiking boots i can't remember what those are called um i should do they've got a zip obviously to make it a little bit easier to get your, your foot in and the platform is pretty much that big so the heel you're walking on is about that big I'd say so it's certainly not um, too bad in terms of angle or anything in case you don't know what material they are they're actually a suede which I didn't really know until they arrived um, I think I sort of suspected I don't know it's kind of in the back of my mind I loved the pattern so I wasn't really concentrating but I really like them so they're a little bit more soft touch than my other Jeffrey Campbell shoes and I think I'm gonna go put them on and let you guys know what I think of them on and everything like that bye So I just tried the shoes on and they are they are just amazing. Um, they're much, much taller than I really expected at all. Let me get one off so I can show you, but um, they're much taller than liters if you're wondering. Um, and they feel a lot kind of um, heavier on the foot, um, but yeah, they're just huge from the front. Now the angle that your foot is at is, as I expected, a little bit more steep than the liters, so they're not going to be um, as long-lastingly comfortable, so you're not going to be able to, well, you might if you're good in heel. For me, uh, at the moment, who's just put them on, they're probably a little bit more tipply, topply um, than my liters, um, just because they are like one huge clumpy shoe, like um, one wedge so it's e slightly easier to kind of fall off them um, I didn't fall but they just felt a little bit more unstable than my liters but certainly something you could definitely get used to if you wore them a lot and I certainly will be wearing them a lot um, other things that I noticed just great design features of Jeffrey Campbell if you can see just inside the shoe there's a flap covering the zip um, that's going to keep your um, the zip from rubbing your leg something that's just really nice to kind of point out because he does just make really good shoes and really wearable shoes as well um, so they're not probably um, quite as comfortable and um, as easy to walk in as liters but those are by far the easiest heels I've ever walked in my, in, in my life so that's certainly not saying much um, they're definitely comfortable as far as I could tell and 
I'm sure I'll get used to walking in them soon. In the, with this kind of boot um, style shoe, I would always wear socks. Um, no matter how well the shoe is made, it will rub if you've got sweaty feet without socks in there um, and you're wearing leather shoes, it, it will just rub. So I'd always recommend to wear it with socks. It's also one of those shoes that looks quite good with your socks pulled up as well, a little bit over them. So because they're kind of that hiking boot style, I went with the usual size that I always go for in Jeffrey Campbell, which is an eight. So um, it looks really small on the bottom because they expand the outwards, but I went for an eight and it fits perfectly, no different to any other Jeffrey Campbell shoe. Um, and you can wear socks with it. Um, probably wouldn't go for extremely thick socks, but you know, um, normal normal socks um, f work fine with it. Um, I personally never feel the need to size down with Jeffrey Campbell. Some people do if you feel um, you can't really keep a heavy shoe on your foot, if your foot muscles aren't used to that or whatever, um, then maybe you would like to go half a size down, but I definitely don't think you ever need to go a whole size down. I hope you enjoyed this shoe unboxing and I am really, really happy with these. I love them. Okay. Bye.